This is going to be a video about problem number five. For problem number five, there's two things you have to know. One is that um, what kind of acid it is. So this first one right here is a strong acid. And strong acids do not need ice tables. When I say you have 0 0.00750 molarity hydrochloric acid, that means you've got 0 0.00750 more H plus. Why? Because that strong acid HCl or any strong acid, any of the seven, breaks up 100% into ions, and one of those ions is H plus. And then you can find pH from right there. You have the concentration of hydrogen ions, which is the same as hydronium, which is confusing, and I apologize for that, but sometimes it's easier to use one and sometimes the other. And then to find hydroxide, you can use this relationship that we just used in this table up here, if you watch that uh, video. Um, so you have hydronium or hydrogen ion concentration. Kw is 1.0 times 10 to the minus 14. And then you can solve for hydroxide ion concentration. Now, for the other ones, for B and C, B and C are both weak acids. Weak acids, you need an ice table. which means you need the Ka value for each of these. And then you, uh, one of your products will be the hydronium ion. You can find the pH from that. And you can also use this equation right here to do the um, find the hydroxide ion concentration as well. I hope this helps.